No care of caddis this time. I headed back out to Bethany, our local lake, and fished the back pond. It was uh, Monday, so it was concert night, so we had a lot of music in the background. Ended up getting some bluegill after about a good hour of nothing. Well, actually, we were getting hits. Uh, just unfortunately, they weren't, um, or we weren't hooking up with them. So when we uh, started out with a foam spider, damselfly, um, some other poppers, and bottom line, it came down to a size 14 elk hair caddis, where we started hooking up with these guys. It was bluegill and bass. Um, we had to cast fairly long distance uh, to get where they were hitting. Noticed a lot of bugs kind of floating around on the surface, and that's what they were feeding on. So uh, triggering off uh, matching the hatch, we uh, stuck with the elk hair caddis and kept uh, hooking up with them once we found the pattern. Good stuff. A lot of fun. Even had some good uh, tunes in the background while we were uh, fishing. So that was a good, uh, good to have. There's a bass, and this should be another bluegill. We did see some big, bigger bass chasing some bait fish in the shallows, uh, but none of them went for our fly. And that was uh, even when we were switching over to the uh, 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 larger flies, they they did not want to uh, strike. But regardless, it was still a good time catching them on the uh, elk hair caddis. Cool stuff. All right. So with steady action with the uh, bluegill. So the uh, traditional elk hair caddis this round. Until next time, we'll catch y'all later, and good luck and good fishing.